What's up, guys? You're going to welcome to the YouTube channel. So, guys, I was just thinking to myself, I have a frequency playing my ears so off. I'm speaking louder than usual. Then you know why. But let's get it popping and cracking. So, I was thinking to myself about how this world is really set up, this mission really set up. And, you know, my personal life, I'm not going to lie, I am a master manifester. I'm able to manifest things odd, oddly enough. Um, I know my life, I've been in a certain situation, but I know like, God has his own divine order of doing things as well. God is in control. So, I don't question everything. However, I know. For some time back. So as I was saying, yes, you're making a living. Yes, you're doing this. Yes, you're doing that. But I'm at a point where, you know, I tried the whole job thing. I got fired because they were hating on me. And I, I continue to grow as a person. And if you want to grow, they're going to do the same thing to you. And it's going to be a cycle where they control people's lives. And, you know, you don't have a say or so. Or how are you are going to make money? How are you going to get by? How are you going to live your dreams? But, you know, now people are waking up to that, at least financially. But people aren't really waking up to the truth. And it's that, yes, you could be financially free. But I was looking at a van earlier. And, you know, I'm, I'm all for working for yourself and having a business. But I was looking at this van. I don't want to say what type of van because it doesn't matter. But I'm like, yes, you're working for you. Yes, you're your own boss now. But you're behind the wheel of a car all day long, you know. And who knows? I don't know if he's doing it for his love of it. But I know there's a lot of people out here that's, you know, really just doing stuff because they want to make the money still. And, yes, it's working for themselves. But they're still doing it. And they don't really love it. You get what I'm saying? So that's just another trap. And there's so many different traps in this reality that it would get you less, just sucked into it. And you don't want to get sucked into this place because it's not a good place to be because all they're doing is teaching you that you're nobody, basically. You're not You're not anything. You're not worth anything. And, you know, we can control you. We can control your life. We can, we can put anything in front of your face. We can control you to do that. And you don't know it. You don't realize it. But you're under a whole... Uh, how do I say it? Like, if we're, I mean, this is a computer program. So you're under like a, you're under a computer program and you're just an entity in this program because you don't know what you're doing. You don't know why you're doing it. You know, you're going on social media every day. You don't realize you're being controlled to do that. You know, you're putting these sweets in your body, uh, chocolate, um, all these fake candies that will kill you but straight up. Um, all these foods that process things as an unnatural foods that's really killing you. And like I said, taking away there, taking you farther away from your true self and from God because God is in your true self. So, all these things that you consume in your body on a daily basis, along with everything else you're not listed in the beginning part of the video, it's really just fucking you up. So back to what I was saying about things being pushed in your face, these things are being pushed in your face to take you away from yourself. And let me give you guys a little backstory if you don't know me. You know, I'm not going to tell too much, but, you know, I'm a very <laughs> peculiar individual and I'm very smart. And, you know, I didn't even know how intelligent I was until I woke up spiritually. Um, I've always known that I was intelligent and I've always done stuff for my subconscious brain because of how, I'm, how intelligent I am. In, I am. <laughs> but I never really knew until recently. And I know a lot of people out there are intelligent, but... You know, we have so many different things. Not only are stuff being put in front of you, but the education system is taking you away from your intelligence and your truth. So it's making you stupider, if that's a word. And it's making you focus on the wrong things and things that won't increase your intelligence, like becoming spiritual. You got what I'm saying? And getting information from, you know, the source instead of getting information from those books that it's false information. And just how I said, like, they put something in front of you, it's all planned out. This stuff is planned out. And the history that you learn in the books is planned out as well. And half the stuff you're reading is not right or some kind of, fictional tale of it or it's just it's just not right and it's to mislead you and the program is to program your subconscious brain the person that's reading it to think a certain way about life and that's not how life actually is and those things some of those things didn't happen in history and if they did they're changing characters you know they're whitewashing uh black people who made an impact on this planet to make us feel like we're less than and we're not less than we're more than and we're infinite and we're very intelligent and you're intelligent too no matter what race you are and we're all supposed to come together but it's been also designed to take us away from each other so i could go on and on and on and it's like a it's a rabbit hole because it's just so much information and things that they do to the point where if you're really caught in a web and you're functioning in society you know when these people driving these cars or we're going to job going to work or thinking a certain way and i think how we're supposed to be thinking which is out of our heart and doing what we love and living to love people and be a nice kind person and to make the world grow and create on this world then it's only there's only one other way you can go and that's taken away from this world and I've made so many videos about gang stalking and things that's happening to me and all this stuff that's happening in my reality and showing you my path for a reason, you know. I didn't have to record any of this. I didn't have to show you guys my path. I didn't have to record any of this stuff, you know. I know I have to come out here and give my message about the truth. And But as far as, like, show my personal life and, you know, what's really going on in my life and 
my journey, who's following me, this happened, telling you about my personal problems and stuff. Not all of it, obviously, but showing you my life. Like, this stuff that nobody on YouTube would really ever show you on camera, but I felt like I'd be helping somebody at least to show you guys that, you know, I'm going through it too. And I didn't know where my life was going when I started doing this. I didn't know what was going to happen, but, you know, I still picked up that camera and decided to, like I said, show you guys the insides of my life, like what's actually going. Like, I was home, <laughs> I was in my car, chilling like a villain. I go on my spiritual journey. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna record. And then, you know, the universe is telling me to record a video. So I kept on recording. I kept on recording. And I didn't upload that at first because, you know, I wasn't confident in myself at the time, but the spiritual journey has allowed me to become more confident in myself and to really be who I am and to learn who I am and learn that I'm really unique and different and learn how to love myself and learn how to talk to myself nicely and learn how to treat myself and learn how to be happy, you know, because life's about happiness. But back to what I was saying, <laughs> You guys see what I what I like what I've done just to show you, and I'm still in my current situation. And to me, you know, it's been longer than I would like. I'm not gonna lie to you, but I do know that God has a plan for me, and God's gonna help me and assist me, and the universe is gonna help me assist me because that's what they're here to do, and I'm gonna get through it. And I want to say this also: not all this to the videos, right? Not really. <laughs> also. Yeah, I forgot it, huh? <laughs> also, all bad things are not actually bad. It's all about your perception. And it's something I've suffered on my journey. And I say that because all bad things are not bad. Um, on my journey, I manifested me becoming the best version of myself because that's what life's about. And that's what God has put us on the earth to do. Right? I wrote that in the journal. I set the intention a while back. So... Not knowing how the universe truly worked because it was the beginning of my journey, um, the universe took me down a path, and it was a path different from my path. I'll make a video about my old path, and you guys are gonna have to watch that. <laughs> and put me on a path where I would learn myself, become spiritual, become who I truly am supposed to be, which is like a person that's doing this, learning how to do this properly. And go, like I said, go back to my videos when I first started coming back on YouTube, and you'll see. But I have so many different things, talents, purposes, and you do too. And you would never know if you, unless you want to express your journey, want to decide yourself and learn who you are and get away from this matrix like I am out here, out here at the park. But let me get back to what I was saying, the main topic. Putting stuff in front of your face. Even the guys, like, this is something that I, you know, I had to let go of my spiritual journey. But like I said, we're not perfect, so don't, don't think that... <laughs> My, my, I'm not on the camera to show you guys I'm perfect. That's what I was learning my journey. But I'm here to show you what I do know because we can, we can strive towards better. We, I know that's better because I'm on the other side where I'm outside of nature, connected with my, my spirit guys, my angel guys, which are you know angels that are in your life that can show you the way to you being happy, you knowing yourself and learning yourself and living a feeling life. And you know I don't want to talk about people, but I do know people in life are not really the happiest right now and i've experienced it over and over and over again like i said watch my other videos you see the experiences you know it's not just from you know it is demons and spirits in these people and it's a spiritual warfare and all these things going on but you gotta realize there's still people behind these bodies at the same time and you know everything still is a choice but people are being controlled but if that makes sense to you but back to what i was saying things really be put being put in front of your face to distract you when you know what really matters is what's right in front of us out here is where we come from you know not that we need to be primitive or we're cavemen or you know we just got to throw away our whole life completely and we don't we can't, maybe something in that life you know you loved or whatever we we're able to be free we're able to do everything we want and that's what people lie about spirituality because we're able to be free but they society has just taught us that everything is wrong like closing your eyes and meditating you know but now it's it's changing but you know I'm not gonna lie, I can recognize that it's changing because they know it's changing, so they're trying to profit off of it as much as possible and to insinuate that these people, you know, the people that are in control of the elites, um, a, certain de a certain demographic on YouTube are really the ones that, you know, spirituality came from or the masters of spirituality or, you know, want to help the world. And in reality, they're like, they're just trying to have like an overcast over it. Like they've done everything else. Like with this whole society, they kind of, they know what's gonna happen, you know, and they plan out around all this stuff. So how there was a shift in the universe with this third to fifth dimensional shift, um, you know, there were people that spoke about it ahead of time and planned around it. However, 
they're not really showing the people on YouTube who are actually speaking the truth and actually trying to wake people up. Like, I don't want to say any names in this video, but you get what I'm saying? Like, the media is, is controlled, so they plan ahead of time to control that media or whatever it is being put on it, just in case something this happens and mask it something else, you know? While this shift is happening, they're putting war in front of your face. Now they have, you know, the discernment she's open, so the amount of experience and a lot of entities are on this planet, but you have children, you know, shooting up schools. I don't really want to talk about that because it's not a channel's floor. But that's just something in the Matrix. And there's so many different things. You know, the food shortage, um, that's happening. Um, the price going up on everything, inflation, whatever you want to call it, gas prices going up. They have things like this in front of your face and they're going to do it. They're going to continue to put that fear in front of your face. Straight fear, 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 fear. They feed you all that fear in your mouth and you're loving it. And you don't realize it's actually making you feel unhappy on the inside. And the more unhappy you feel, the less control you have in your body because you're not in your root chakra where it's, it's nothing. And it's farther away from yourself. And we have seven chakras. Look it up. And those seven chakras are to be activated for us to be in our God body and to really control our world and, you know, choose to be happy and have control over everything that's happening versus being controlled by this world with what they're putting in front of you and things that they're lying to you about because everything is a lie in this world. Everything is a lie. There's no, there's, there's half truth with stuff. Don't get it twisted. There's half truth and everything. And they could tell you the truth while lying and tell you the truth if that makes sense <laughs> at the same time. But you get what I'm saying? It's not the real deal spill. And they do that. And I know you've probably heard this before, if you know about what's going on in this world, because they have to put the truth in your face because it's part of the ritual. You get what I'm saying? They're playing, they're playing tales with the universe and the universal laws and tricks on the universe and universal laws by manipulating things a certain way to fulfill their wicked agendas and putting it in their mind that the wicked that they're doing, like killing people internally with the fools, what they consume, what they watch, what they see, what they participate in versus... Um, not doing that. You get what I'm saying? If that makes sense. <laughs> I'm speaking a lot. I know. But. It's been good. <laughs> it's been good. But, um. And I've been. Let me talk about myself for a lot. Yeah, I'm going to talk about myself. But. Um. I've been out here for a little bit. I'm chilling. And like I said. I, I try to avoid people nowadays. Because I try to keep my energy clean and pure. And me just being around people. It's just. I'm an empath. Like I said. Go look up what an empath is. If you don't know what that is. But. And do your research, by the way. Do your research on your own topics. And it's something I'm learning as well. Don't get research, not everything, at least from YouTube. Start going on other websites and stuff that I actually have credit or some kind of reputation. Not Wikipedia all the time. But Wikipedia, I'm not going to lie. It tells the truth. It tells the truth. I'm not going to lie to you. Wikipedia tells the truth. But that's another thing. I was told in uh, middle school, Wikipedia was bad. And Wikipedia just gives you that straight truth like that. And it's pretty accurate. You know, I've heard people can edit it, but... You know what I'm saying? It's still, if the camera keeps cutting off, you know, iCloud and iPhone, you know, they be, they finesse. Um, they don't want me to record a lot of videos. Hey, Rich, what's your YouTube channel? Hey, but if you guys like the video, donate. Donate. Donate to my cash app. Just donate, bro. Help a nigga out. Peace.